Welcome to Chase Trade Autos. Here we have our BMW 635D automatic. The car is on a 2008-08, covered just 92,000 miles. This car, brand new, uh, from Sydney, was £58,685. It also has uh, £3,500 of optional extras. The car is finished in metallic space grey. As you can see from the front of the vehicle, it's got the Corona rings, or angel eyes as you call it. Um, these are also adaptive as well, so uh, obviously it's got a high beam assist on it. It's got front and rear parking sensors. Um, the alloys on the car, I believe they're 18 inch. I'm just going to have a look. We've got Bridgestone tyres as well. So as you can see, Bridgestone, it's been well cared for. You can see there's loads of tread on them. I estimate in the region of probably 6 mil. Uh, new tyres only come usually with sort of, uh, you know, 7 mil as standard. Those actual alloys are 19 inch and they do look absolutely fabulous. I'll just come back now with the camera, you can see just how stunning this vehicle is. It's absolutely amazing. And the colour of the metallic paintwork is absolutely flawless. I mean, look at the shine on that. It looks beautiful. So on the BMWs, obviously, they're always staggered from the back. So as the wheels on the back are obviously a lot wider than the front one, it just gives you a lot better sort of control of the vehicle and adds to the uh, the stability of the vehicle so on the 635d this is the one to have it is the best one that they produce uh, this car produces about 280 brake horsepower it's got about 500 pounds of torque so 0 to 60 is not a problem in this vehicle but you will still get uh, a really decent mpg return from the car looking at the back you can see it's got the twin tail pipe so obviously finished in a lovely sort of chrome looks absolutely beautiful uh, so the rear parking sensors and obviously the, the badge at the back, you flick that and obviously the boot comes up, as you can see on the hydraulics and look how deep that boot is, it, it, although this is a coupe, it is a four seater, it's, you know, it's still ideal for you know, anyone that has a lot of sort of baggage, there's a really deep boot on it and again if I just zoom in on that you can see the metallic paint from the fleck in it just how nice it is. So on the car, uh, there's no curb marks on the alloys or anything like that. It's got Bridgestone tyres all the way round. Um, it's got some nice vents there as well, just to add to the detail. So just taking you inside the vehicle now, the car has got two keys. It's got the full black Dakota leather. Now the interior trim on this vehicle, we are considering changing it as it is a bit sort of like a mature only sort of trimming it. Now we can change it for piano black gloss, which I think will look a lot better, or sort of like an aluminium look. Uh, choice is yours really, I'd be, I'd be quite happy to do that free of charge. We've done this to many of our vehicles, it looks absolutely superb. Now, one of the main things with this car is it has got the memory seats and the electronic uh, reach and rake on the steering. So I'll just show you how that works. Obviously I've set number three up to my sort of seating position. Just push number three, you can see the seats all moving back. Uh, we've also noticed the steering wheels moving as well at the same time and this will set it perfectly to uh, how I sort of sit in my seat so if you know your wife drives a car or a, a business partner or something like that you can have your seats all set to different numbers there's no messing about you get the perfect sort of driving position so this car has got the £2,000 um, professional navigation upgrade it's got the Bluetooth on it with um, Bluetooth preparation. It's also got the F1 style paddle shift and it is the new style gearbox as well. Uh, cruise control, push button start. So if we just take you inside the vehicle now. Pop the key in. So the car's due a service, which we're just about to do to the vehicle. And it has got full history with, with sitting in this vehicle. So you can see obviously the service lights on. Fuel light as always. Uh, but obviously we'll make sure there's fuel in it. You can see it's got the paddle shifts on either side. So you either push that down to go down here and up to go up a gear. Um, it's got the heated seats all here. Uh, parking control, which when you put it into reverse, if you look at the TV screen, it comes up with the sensors so you can visually see where you are. Uh, put it into park, it turns that off. It's got the climate control. Obviously with the professional navigation, it's also got uh, the facility to uh, store CDs to the hard drive. Um, you've also got your, sort of your phone cradle there. Underneath the phone cradle, 
you've got the auxiliary port which is down the bottom so if you're using an iPod or anything like that it is electric seat on the left hand side and it's also got the uh, SOS button should you have an accident in the car or you see an accident if you touch this button it'll call BMW online services where they can uh, uh, sort of alert the appropriate uh, emergency services for the vehicle and it's got auto white and auto lights um, just going to the menu you can see the sat nav there you can actually get it on full screen it's a split screen at the minute so this screen to the right you can actually change you know what you've got on there by just scrolling through so you might want to have it in the direction of travel you can see you've got two different maps there um, just makes it a lot easier to use a bit easier to understand the information that's been provided to you it has got dvd on it so if you put a dvd it should play uh, you know through the actual screen there it's got the auto dip rear view mirror electric windows electric mirrors it's got the hi-fi upgrade sound system it's not harman kardon but it is bmw's sort of own version of that which comes with about nine speakers so it's got the sort of glove box as well with the six disc changer at the back that's pretty much it on here. Obviously, you've got your sport button. Uh, obviously, you've got the Tiptronic as well, which you cock the gearbox to one side. Um, you've got the controls there, which sort of control the lights inside, and obviously, the navigation got your voice control ready. on this side. Below there, you've got your cruise control, and you've also got the steering adjustment. So, you can see obviously that sort of moves the steering wheel up and down and in and out. And again, that can all be set by the um, by the memory function on this. Um, so like I said the dashboard can be changed. The doors on this car as well, the pillarless, so you can see when you get into a tight spot in a car park, even though it is a coupe, if the window's down, you can actually get a bit more space. If you can have it to there, you can actually still get around the car to get in. Um, which makes things a lot easier with these vehicles because they are big. It is a big vehicle. So the car's going to go through our X2 point inspection. You can see now the uh, the bodies that on headlights are on. You can see just how nice they are. There's no chips and chips and things on the vehicle either. So if anyone's interested in the car, it is an 08. You can get five years finance on the car. You need a no deposit or low deposit finance. Uh, we're happy to do the uh, any car that comes in on part exchange should give you great value for the car, better than what you get the main dealers. Uh, give us a call 01623 709 907 alternative. You can visit the website at chasetrailautos.co.uk.